This here is a Batman page from J.H. Williams. Actually, it's Detective Williams, num Detective Williams, Detective Comics number 821 by J.H. Williams. Um, you know, J.H. Williams is one of my favorite artists. Uh, this is actually one of three distinct styles that he does his penciling in. And I'm not a great, uh, you know, orator or I'm not great at talking about artwork or even comic artwork, but I just love his the blacks and just the way he draws i mean this is just one of the many amazing things that he's done um i have his uh artist edition for sandman which is just breathtaking it's amazing um right here uh this is nathan fox um from what i understand this art piece is from him um doing a drawing for a magazine about um, Death Proof, the Quentin Tarantino movie. So it's that scene and uh, it's just amazing. Uh, it's beautiful. I mean, he really reminds me of, uh, although his style, well, his style reminds me of Paul Pope. Um, but I don't, I think he's mentioned that he wasn't, he actually, when he started drawing, he, he didn't even know about Paul Pope. But I do love both of them and I love Nathan Fox and I'm grateful to have this piece. Um, this one combines two of my greatest loves. Um, comic books and baseball and it's by uh james stoko um i do like the comic book it's really um it's sullivan's uh sluggers um really you want to come for the art and stay for the art the story is fine it's really about the art and coloring which james stoko kicks ass on um yeah i love the guy i love his artwork uh, i mean i don't know the guy but i do love his artwork um here is my main man uh, artwork by uh, Matthew Southwort um, of Stumptown. This is uh, the second volume of Stumptown. Um, I think I'm so privileged that I was able to uh, get this from Matt. Um, he's just an amazing artist. And when I say artist, I mean like writer, artist, musician, and, a, and just a great guy. But I mean, just, just on art alone, you take a look at this. I mean... He did so much um, research uh, for that comic book. Like some of the issues when you buy buy them, uh, if you still can get some of those issues, I would definitely get him for the process because he'll, he'll have pictures of himself like in the back of the trunk, like seeing like how it looks like. He lives in Seattle or nearby Seattle, but drove all the way down to Portland to try to learn like all the nuances of the city. So it's amazing. I also love this piece because it... Um, it features the old Mustang instead of her new Mustang. So, uh, unfortunately, it's beat up, but the artwork is stupendous. Chef's kiss. Hi right here. Uh, this artwork, again, another privilege um, of getting Gabriel Hard Hardman, Hardman's Batman. Uh, I think this is from a newly, uh, not new, but maybe like five or six years ago, um, DC came out with uh, Legends of the Dark Knight. And um, I just, uh, I'm so grateful I got to have this. I have another piece from him that I'll probably showcase another time. But um, it's, it's amazing. I love it.